The next game you will be seeing is so awesome, we need a little bit of a warm-up first. <laughs> All right, it's a bit different. <laughs> <laughs> I love this song. Oh, it's so thrilling. It's, it's a catchy song. You just don't get more 80s than this. Yes, I think this is the peak of the 80s. Full <laughs> 80s. It's more 80s than the 80s. Not just 80s, it's American 80s. Oh my god, it needs to end. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, I think you're ready now. I think that's enough of a warm-up. This game is called Runes Escape. It is like a day set game, but for the Mac, of course. Which of course means it is top-notch. Top-notch, high-quality games from the Mac App Store, as always on my channel. Yeah, so a lot of people complain about games like they said and H1Z1, the new uh, zombie game that was released. They're all in early access and they're a bit buggy and glitchy. And people complain they're not completed yet and have bad performance. They're simply not playable, but yeah, look at this. <laughs> this is a sort of survival apocalypse game on the Mac. I don't know what you talking about. I think it looks awesome. So yeah, this is not early access. Uh, this is in the App Store and this is standard in the App Store. <laughs> <laughs> this is full, official and complete. Oh, check out that engine sound. Lovely. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can drive a car. They give you a car for a start. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's better than some games. I mean, there's a lot of games you can't even do that in, so... Featured for all this game. Every time you get in that car, the sound has a fit. <laughs> All the sound, including it's the background music. <laughs> it's horrible. <laughs> but the car's the fastest way to get around. Although there may be trees in the way. And if you uh, don't mind your ears bleeding. Yes. <laughs> so at first I thought, the map's quite big. It looks open world. But it's not that big. <laughs> as you could imagine. You were just driving around in circles the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> so the whole point of the game is to collect eight uh, cans of fuel, I guess. And if you have those eight cans, you can fly away with a plane, which you will see later. Let's have a look at the uh, store page. He's got a hat on with a billy on it and a smiley face. Ah, oh, that's nice. He must be a happy guy. Find fuel for a helicopter. It's the only way out of here. Uh... It was a plane, not, not a helicopter. They look the same, helicopter, planes, who knows how this thing works. Maybe you only get the helicopter again if you pay for the game. So yeah, meet uh, Robert, the uh, giant zombie. Oh, hey guys. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, this is freaky. Shoot it, shoot and, it. And it's dead. <coughs> oh, that was anticlimactic. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, the zombies are really slow. Uh, we can just run away. Yeah, just ignore them. And there's weapons all over the place. They look a bit like weapons from GTA. It does. It looks like a bit of GTA 3. Oh, is there any kind of melee weapons or is it all uh, guns? I think it's all guns. Oh my god, those frames. Yeah, uh, <laughs> that's not my PC, that's the game. <laughs> my PC isn't that good, but I don't think your PC would uh, handle it. Better. If you're interested, you could install Mac somehow and then try. Uh, yeah. No. No. <laughs> so basically, no. <laughs> oh, there's a nice little trailer home there. The standard American uh, map. Trailers and guns everywhere. <laughs> yeah, that's basically America in a nutshell. New cars to drive through the city, new gameplay and control modes, new under characters, new location with amazing graphics. There we go. Amazing. Amazing graphics. Be faster, stronger, pay attention, and don't stay at one place for a long time. Run and escape. Well, the zombies aren't really fast. I was going to say, <laughs> stay at one place. It'd take, I don't know, a good few hours for one of the zombies to get to you. <laughs> yeah. If a zombie breaks through the door, you could just uh, have a nap, make dinner, and it still wouldn't have reached you. There's actually a customer review on the... Um, Oh, is there? Only three stars. Come on. It's really good, don't get me wrong. It's just that the moving controls are inverted and it's really lecky. Lecky. <laughs> Shows a lot of lag. <laughs> and whenever you hit a zombie, the car just stops. <laughs> yeah. 
They're very tough zombies. They're slow, but... It was going quite well when suddenly uh, I got stuck. Well, that's the 4x4 uh, four four stuck. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot move it at all. That's a bit of a problem. Yeah, and running is really slow as well. You notice at the bottom there's a bit of advertisement. I think I would need to unlock the full version. But, yeah, no. Yeah, I'm surprised you haven't already paid for the full version. Yeah, I, I might have to blow this out, but the, the advertisement is uh, kind of funny as well. <laughs> advertisement <laughs> for even better games. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't even look remotely related, the adverts that are popping up to this game. It's like, <laughs> you like this zombie game? You may like these fluffy animals. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Uh, you notice the bad performance, but sometimes it runs really well. But as soon as you kind of look at the wheat field, the FPS, it's horrible. As soon as you look into the distance and try and get some range on it, it's like, there's too much. Wait a minute, is this a fuel station? Yes. <laughs> can't you just get the fuel from the fuel station? I don't have enough uh, cans. I don't. I can't carry it. You can just do it one at a time and walk backs and forwards. So I'm like, at the gas station, there should be a car, but nope, nothing. And there's actually advertising for a cart game. I could really do it for cart right now. Yep. Well, it knows you're looking for a car, so it's like, well, if you want a car, you could at least try getting a cart in this game. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God, that is... <laughs> Really, really terrible when you're looking that way. <laughs> yes, I think it's the wheat field. So I'm just looking down and walking like an old man. Look at the really, really detailed grass. This wheat field is just... It kills it. It's too much. They put too much detail into the wheat. That's the problem. <laughs> yeah, wheat simulator. Look at the iron site on the right. It's brilliant as well. <laughs> That's a very weird way of doing it. Completely detached from the player. I've never seen it like that. No. It's so innovative. Unique. <laughs> and here you can see the iron sight works quite well in the field. Oh, yeah, you can see exactly where you're looking. Headshot. There we go. Pro. 360 okay. no scope. So, yeah, what would you do in a zombie apocalypse? In a zombie apocalypse, um, I'd go to the supermarket. The supermarket? <laughs> yeah. In your That's town. Where the food is. Yeah, but yeah. everyone wants to get there. True. Depends, though. If everyone's a zombie, then. <laughs> I think what I would do is, before the apocalypse starts, I would go to Norway, build myself a fortress out of wood, and buy some laser turrets, and I'm sorted. Yeah, laser turrets would work. Ooh, look at this car. Yeah, I found a new car. It's a nice pickup. Well, it's it's Same engine noise. And I think, yeah, I'm going to free the other car. How about that? That's a good idea. I think these are the only two cars on the map, so I thought, better free the other one in case uh, I got stuck again. And what happened... I got stuck again. <laughs> Whoops. This goddamn hill. It's just this hill. This little steep <laughs> bit that's wobbling around like crazy. Oh, don't tell me you can't get back into the other car. Yeah. Yes, I can. You got... <laughs> that I was, was say, I thought you got them both stuck for a second there. <laughs> that would have been just typical. So, yeah. So, there you go. Physics. Whoa. So, you've uh, traded your pickup for the... The rubbish 4x4 four four. yeah so I freed all of them and back to low frame rates through the fields the wheat anything but the wheat oh, this is so great this game so I'm really looking for the last canisters I cannot find them it's just weird this is where I started although it's not a big map it's actually easy to get lost by the looks of it because it all looks the same yeah exactly and you can definitely tell where the map ends because there's just no grass <laughs> and no detail so this is the plane I need to uh, get fuel into it's a big plane because apparently I have enough fuel for cars, but, well, infinite fuel for cars. Yeah, you can drive around for hours in your car. Yeah. Just empty the fuel out of the car. Yeah. But hey, it's a zombie apocalypse. We need to collect stuff. Yeah, you can't have a zombie apocalypse without going out and We've had finding looting. fuel. <laughs> I guess on the iPhone and the iPad, it's not too bad. Uh, if it's free. If you yeah. want some DayZ action on the phone. I think the uh, smaller the screen you're using, the better it may be. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so you have played a lot of DayZ, the mod, right? Not yeah, I've played a fair bit. So how does it compare? Oh, there's there's no comparison. I mean, this is way better. Yeah, exactly. I, I would m much prefer to play this. This is not the early access. This is not the mod. Exactly, this is yeah. finished. It's a complete release. It's all done and dusted. And are you stuck again? 
Yeah, guess what? I'm stuck again. And <sighs> I'm floating a bit. Lovely. <laughs> I'm like a, a magician floating in the air. Look at that. That requires skill. <laughs> yes. I'm really pissed at the moment. What can I do to free this car? Well, there's a, a barrel next to it, maybe? Explosive? No. Nope. Damn. Maybe the whole thing explodes? Maybe? 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 No. I, I couldn't find the last four cans. I, they're nowhere on the map. I, I, I'm, I'm not sure. I don't think you can actually complete the game. Maybe you have to pay for the game to get the last four cans. Oh, that might actually be true. Wow. <laughs> I wouldn't put it past it. Yeah. Seems like that kind of game. <laughs> the last thing I wanted to try out is, has the map an end? Is there an end to the world? Oh. And, and there actually is. Yay. And what's beyond this border of awesomeness? There is nothing. <clears throat> And there's nothing underneath as well. Oh. We need something better to watch. This one, this is the full 50 minutes of Aerobic National Championship USA 1988. That's more like it. Oh yeah, look at that. Why are they all so happy? Yeah, it's a happy time, the 80s. In those they the had no such thing as zombie games with bad the graphics. High. Look at them, they're all happy. No video games. Shitty ones. <laughs> Check that hair out on the host. <laughs> yeah, as well, yeah. That's great. <laughs> wow. <laughs> this is like the uh, the Voice UK in the 80s with dancing people. Yeah. It's knackering me out just watching them. I'm feeling really tired. <laughs> I'm exhausted. Too much energy on these people. Coming home from work, you're tired? Just watch this and... Uh, you're ready to go again. This cheers you up. You can stop the recording. Okay, but I'm going to keep watching the National Aerobic Championship. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's really good. The music's so good. 